Okay, so we are done with Algolia. Now we need to display the users that we receive from Algolia right here. So what we're going to be doing, we're going to have an array of results right here. And as soon as we find data from Algolia, we're going to push to this array. Okay, so what we're going to be doing is saying this dot results is equal to the content dot hits. Okay, because when we search Algolia, let me go ahead and inspect right here. We discover that the data we receive from Algolia is an object and we have a hits array where all of the objects of the users that it found is kept in. Okay, so right there we have this dot results equals content dot hits and uh, now we have our results array. So we need to loop through that array right here in this row. So just to keep things very simple, it's not about the design but it's about how it functions. Okay, so I'm gonna have, so I'm just gonna have a div the text center and I'm gonna loop through my results okay so v4 user in results and this results is our results array right here okay and uh, we're gonna have an avatar so we'll just say image and would we'll bind the source property to the user dot avatar so if we go ahead and check that out in our console right there we have the user's model has an avatar and uh, we also have a name, so we'll just do name an avatar. Okay, so we bound the image to the user's avatar and we'll also write out the name. Okay, so it's a text center right there, and this is gonna be the user that name right there. Okay, so that's practically all we need, but let's go ahead and put a v if right here v if results dot length. Okay, so it means if this results array is empty, we are not gonna display this row, but as soon as it's no longer empty we're gonna display the list of users. So let's go ahead and try that out and hopefully it should work as expected. I'll just give a refresh and uh, right here I'll just search for my name and hit enter and you discover right there we have Franz, we have Catherine and we have Buddy Sipes right there, okay? So if I search for maybe Nico, we discover we have Dr. Nicole, Wally and all that. So these avatars are not displaying because there's something probably wrong with our avatars. And right here we see they have a local host rather than my domain right here. Okay, but other than that, everything works perfectly. We are receiving the name and I think we're gonna fix that in a, another lesson. But we can go ahead and try searching for things. When we search, we receive the results instantly right there. Okay, so if we search for anything, we receive the results instantly okay so if you want to put this in a drop down go ahead and do that but this is how it works and everything works perfectly okay so thank you for watching and see you in the next video